This just in, the internet is angry at Nicole Arbor. So what else is new? Welcome back to IO, I'm Charlotte Dobre. Unless you live under a rock, you've seen the Childish Gambino video for This Is America. The video is probably one of the most important pieces of social commentary in recent history. Just saying. It's a powerful statement about black issues in America, like police brutality, the monetization of the church, and gun violence. It really is an amazing video, if you haven't seen it, definitely check it out. When you're done watching this video, of course. Well, Nicole Arbor decided to release her own version of the song called This Is America Women's Edit, where instead of black issues, Nicole Arbor brings to light the issues of women. Naturally cause, well this is Nicole Arbor we're talking about, she received a lot of online backlash for her video. People called it a white woman's edit, where she took a video about black issues in America and whitewashed it. She released a statement responding to the backlash that basically said that she created the video with every intention of bringing a light to women's experiences. Things like date rape, drugging, breastfeeding, pressures to create a family, workplace harassment, and the glass ceiling. She further said in the statement that other people should make their own edits of This Is America to show struggles from different perspectives. I can't tell if people are angry that someone remade an important piece of social commentary or if they're angry because it was Nicole Arbor that did it. Nicole Arbor is one of the most controversial internet personalities out there. I mean, she was literally the girl who made the Dear Fat People video and also apparently beat up and emotionally abused Matthew Santoro when they were in a relationship. By the way, that was never proven, this is just something Matthew Santoro claimed. But it was all anyone could talk about for a long time. What do you think about Nicole Arbor's video? Personally, this is just my two cents, I think that the issues she was bringing to light are important and prevalent, but maybe it would have been nice to see her do something new, not piggyback on a popular video because it will get her clicks. I do believe she did have the best intentions and I don't think she deserves to be hated on for trying to shed a light on women's issues. Let me know what you think of the story in the comments below, it's time to respond to some comments from previous videos. Daniel Collins said, growing an ear in your arm, what's next, growing a potato in your nose? That would actually be good, but painful. Wouldn't it be awesome if we could grow potatoes in our noses? You'd never go hungry. No one said, how do you know all these information? I want to know. By the way, where's Charlotte? We know all these information because it's our job to know all these information. And I'm right here. Hey. By the way, I'm going to be in Europe next week, so be really nice to Ron and Rebecca when they're covering for me. I'm watching you. Be nice. The video is over. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to show this channel some love by giving this video a thumbs up, subscribing, and turning on notifications. Do you want to go on an IO binge? Of course you do. There's a playlist right over here that we put together for you. By the way, we got social media. We have Instagram, Facebook, and Twitter. Scroll down to the description for all of our links. That's it for me. See you in the next video.